scanning. Neural imaging shows your psychoactive potential is at or near peak level. Hello, Dr. Yu. Diagnosing superficial injuries. Nothing a portable medical kit can handle. Try to relax. There. Hello. All better. You can fill out a service questionnaire at the front desk. Hello, Dr. Yu. Find anything good in that armory? Well, I was gonna give you the code, but I guess you don't need it. Still, I sure would appreciate being let out of here. M my name's Aaron. Aaron Ingram. Hey, oh, whoa, whoa, whoa! Just what the hell are you doing? What's that thing doing in there, huh? Shit! You! I told you not to do it! Oh, shit! People are quick to project human features onto things they don't understand. The Typhon kill us without hesitation. But it's not because they're evil. It's because they can't do otherwise. Do you know what we discovered? They lack mirror neurons. For all their wonderful abilities, there's one thing we can do that they can't. 
empathize with the suffering of another living creature. Morgan, did you hesitate? At all? I'm sure he wasn't a good man, but could you have done otherwise, given the opportunity? The Typhon can only kill and destroy, but you're human. You have a choice. produced by Transtar contains exotic materials derived from a Mimic. If you've been paying attention, you know how Mimics get made. Alien threat detected. But when do you think we'll get to that breach? I met it out there as we speak. What do you think happened? Hard to say until I lay eyes on it. Could be some micrometeoroids bunched to hold. <sighs> Rare, but it happens. Okay, good. Hopefully it's just that. Is there something you're not telling me? No, of course not. It's just that storage room has classified exotic materials. We really can't have it be inaccessible. Uh... I understand. Typhon are capable of, and not capable of, it seems prudent to revisit the Project Cobalt material. Igor, neuromods can already adapt Typhon material to the human mind. There's no reason in principle the reverse wouldn't work. Say you manage to insert human neurons into a Typhon. How will you know it was successful? The new neural structures would need to mature over a series of actual experiences. Or simulated ones. What? Simulate the experiences. Calvino, he has... Right, okay, look, it's fascinating, but let's focus on what we know is working. 
I don't want anyone devoting resources to this. Hello, are you here for an appointment?
welcome. Maybe I can help you.
I was afraid of this. The scientists here were in the middle of something when they died. Access to the guts is closed off during experiments. Security protocol. You'll have to finish what they started. Back in the 60s and 70s, the first research teams tried to communicate with the Typhon, but this proved impossible. Their cerebral structures are highly developed and intentional, but somehow unapproachable. They have no speech of their own, no language. They don't even seem to see us. Not like we see ourselves, I mean. I'm generalizing when I say us, of course. I'm not a person. Not like you. Live exam procedure in progress. Local lockdown in effect until procedure terminates. Compromised. Accessories required. Warning. Examination theater compromised. Warning. Examination theater compromised. <laughs> language. They don't even seem to see us. Not like we see ourselves, I mean. I'm generalizing when I say us, of course. I'm not a person. Not like you. Live exam procedure in progress. Local lockdown in effect until procedure terminates. Android version 0.7.6. Theater compromised. Warning. Examination. Theater compromised. Live exam terminated. Lifting local lockdown. Thank you. 
Anderson suffered some wear and tear. How is that? Ready to have no blink. This isn't the first time a Typhon organism has broken containment. It happened before, shortly after your initial Neuromod tests. You and Alex fought about terminating the project, evacuating, but Alex insisted he could control the situation. That's when you began implementing secret contingencies, hiding the plan for your arming key, videos, the January protocol. Your concerns have proven to be correct.
Maybe I can help you. Diagnosing. There. All better. Hello, Dr. Hughes. Excuse me. Welcome. Maybe I can help you. Hello.
Specimens required. Attention. Station leadership has issued an alert. All personnel should report to muster stations immediately and await further instructions.
Psionic aptitude available. Hello, Volunteer. My name is Bianca Goodwin. I'm the Volunteer and Guest Liaison aboard Talos One. I wanted to be the first person to congratulate you when you woke. On behalf of... and engineers. So, please, rest easy for now. Once you feel well enough, I'll come by to conduct your exit interview. See you soon. Hello, Bonnie. I wanted to be the first person to congratulate you when you woke. On behalf... Welcome. Sorry. Maybe well I can help you. And thank you. I'm sure you feel disoriented. One, I wanted to be the first person to congratulate you when you woke. On behalf of everyone at Transtar, well done. Hello, sure are you here for an appointment? This is because you've just experienced a medical procedure known as optoregressive neurotomy. For the next few hours, you might have trouble with fine motor...
to know your willing participation was a big success. It's already yielding valuable information for our scientists and engineers. I wanted to be the first person to congratulate That's unfortunate. We'll have to improvise. There's no back in the foyer. They're all this isn't safe. Who do you feel disoriented? This is because you've just experienced a medical procedure known as optoregressive neurotomy. 
For the next few hours, you might have trouble with fine motor skills or recalling details. Memory of the test is completely gone. But don't worry. I want you to know your willing participation was a big success. Thank you. 